Those in the red area are facing grave danger of death. It was a dire warning following the Norfolk Southern train derailment in East Palestine, Ohio on February 3rd. 38 cars leave the track, 11 carrying hazardous materials, including vinyl chloride, a known carcinogen. Evacuations, a controlled burn, fears of contamination, and a massive cleanup. Norfolk Southern will clean the site safely, thoroughly, and with urgency. But that cleanup included Norfolk Southern transferring those toxic materials out of state, some to a deep injection well in Romulus and landfill in Van Buren Township, owned by Republic Services. I don't know how you do that uh, without contacting the local officials. That sparked outrage from Wayne County officials, lawmakers, and residents. Now they're quietly going to bring that toxic material to Michigan and, and dump it in our backyards and possibly put our families in danger. The EPA stepping in to halt the transport and make other arrangements for the disposal. But now local attorneys here are trying to make sure the hazardous waste can't come here again. Irreparable harm could happen to our, to our uh, community if somebody doesn't step up and ask them to stop. Attorney Michael J. Farr says they are seeking an injunction on behalf of a Wayne County resident, a court order to keep Norfolk Southern's East Palestine mess out of Michigan. He says since it was sent here before, it could happen again. Not everything in this world is about money. This lawsuit is not about money. We are not asking for damages. We are doing this case because we feel that it's incumbent upon us to do our, our, our job to protect the community. In Dearborn, Amy Lang, Fox 2 News.